So ready in three, two, one. I'm so glad we can be here today to talk about Fall Q. It's going to be such an amazing. Hey, give me a second, Joe. So are we, we're going to start like this? Oh, yes, James, of course. We're going to start like we have to talk about Fall Q. It's going to be such an amazing. I, I agree. Yeah. And, I, and I'm, I'm excited for Fall Q. But I mean, we're going to start like this. Like I'm just saying, right, like look at my framing, right? Bottom of the chest, top of the head, rule of thirds audio's direct i'm just noticing a fan in your background i mean if i may like i could i could danny are you driving james? what are you talking about james yeah, yeah. what's yeah, wrong I'm with this kids do, this is how we do all of our meetings right because it's comfortable and we're at home and you oh know, my goodness us, like we're oh, not okay, working okay, right okay, now okay okay so okay 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 james you're an audio video specialist can you please tell us how can we make this better i'd love to uh well with all of these, Danny, stop driving, number one. That's 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 just a safety issue. That's not even a video issue. Uh, Joe, I, you have a great head, but I think your head is attached to a body. And I see the ceiling fan in your background. Hey, there you go. I like that. Now, that you, notice, you notice that when you lean forward and then you lean back, right? What happened? So you kind of almost have to overcompensate, right? So like when I go like this to adjust, and then I adjust it and I sit back in my chair and I do this. Right, like I can go up here and my head's cut off, but when I re lean back, all of a sudden I have a bunch of dead space. That's not good. So you want to make sure that bottom of the chest, top of the head, with just a little bit of space there. Hey, it's looking good. All right. See, now we know that you have a, a body attached to that head of yours. So the nice thing is, if we're ever doing it uh, for video production, we can put a lower third graphic that shows your name. Now I have the space to do it. Uh, so, so you're looking good. I see yeah, that you're, you're looking good, Joe. Yeah, you're on a headset. Appreciate that, uh, Jason. Everybody loves to seem to think that they have a boring background in their house, but the windows like showing outside is going to be beautiful. Unfortunately, it just looks like white and blown out. And it's so bad that it doesn't really illuminate your face. So let's have you turn the camera. And I see that you're on a headset, which works. So do you see how the face just got a little bit brighter? Because Zoom's not trying to fit, fight with the background lighting. Um, I'd love if you could cut it out completely. Is there a possibility you can cut out that completely and just move your chair over? There you go. Good. Now let's have you tilt down. There you go. A little more. So again, when you, when you, <laughs> there we go. See how you look just like Joe bottom of chest, top of the head. I just I was, want to be like Joe. I was going to, I was going to go to Jose next, but after seeing, uh, after seeing Danny, I might have to go to Danny first. Uh, Danny. Um, yes. You have a lovely got, foreground. I'm my kids. Shh. I could see kids. that. So unfortunately, we're going to need you to, number one, not be in a moving vehicle. Uh, number two, take that out of, there we go. And so what we need from you is, uh, well, hopefully you have a stand so it's not moving the whole time. Um, but traditionally, if you, if you can be bottom of chest, top of the head, that's the ideal look that everybody wants. And you want to be eye level. So we'll let you slide. Jose, <laughs> let's chat about Jose. Um, and Jose, oh boy, I'm going to just skip you. You're, you're going to need more help. than um, That's a really nice background. It is a great background and that's an awesome background. But once we frame Jose properly, uh, you can see how, by the way, the green screen is kind of going in and out, right? Because the Zoom virtual green screen. Oh. So, hey, now that we hey, see you. There you ya, go. Yeah, you're right in the middle. That looks good. Yeah. So now if you notice, it says CE and I don't know what you're trying to advertise, but it doesn't look like Q anymore. <laughs> so this is the importance of backgrounds. You don't want a background that has text because if you notice, it looks like COE, right? And, and, and Jose's the O here in, in, in CO. Uh, so we don't want that. We want to have a more neutral background. And Jose, you also have a lot of shadowing on the front of your face and a lot of uh, bright light coming in on the side. I'm assuming you have a window over on, over there. Yeah. Yes, so we, you got to try to shade the window a little bit. And by doing that, it's going to make the image a little darker, but Zoom will start brightening up the image and your front of your face will actually be seen a lot better. Mm -hmm. Okay. And if you do have a headset, something very simple, that also helps with audio. Because if you notice, the minute I take this out and I lean back and I'm just kicking back, you see how the audio changed? Now, when I lean forward and I just plug this in and watch what happens when I plug it in, I'm going to keep talking. And now you can hear that it's a higher quality audio, right? So headsets are always a really nice idea. Um, I don't know what's going on with Mercedes, but I just have a yellow image. Oh no, is it yellow? Joe, yellow. upload snap video. Ah, yeah, we don't want to do that. 
let's let's have uh, let's have let's let's smack Joe around later for that. All one. right. So we we're in Zoom, camera? and if I recall correctly, I go to meeting in the upper left hand, and I go to switch camera. And you can, yes, and you can also on the bottom bottom Perfect. left hand. You got it. In the bottom left hand corner where you've got the mute and the stop video. Yep. If you're not going to be talking for a while and you know that, um, a lot of people don't know this, but if you hold. So if all I have to do is a keyboard shortcut. I could click it, but I could also hold down the alt key and hit a. And when I do that. And then we need the you're on mute shirt. Now that's the you're on mute shirt. Exactly. <laughs> so it's a nice way to turn yourself on and off. So if I have to like, if Jason, for example, is talking and I'm about to cough and I know I don't want to interrupt Jason. I just muted myself so it doesn't interrupt Jason or anything. It doesn't distract from Jason's message. Uh, so that's just a quick tri uh, trick. And then the video settings, if you click the little up arrow next to up arrow next to stop video, you'll see all your camera options and alt N and is in new like new camera. Alt N will let you switch between cameras real quick if you need alt that. N alt N. All right. How's my camera now? Your camera looks uh, looks a little grainy. If you have something higher quality, uh, oh, that would be awesome. I do. Let's try Alt N. Okay. Hopefully it works. And if it doesn't work, just go down to the list and hit Alt N. All right. Unfortunately, and and, and typically the the Alt N. See, I can switch to other cameras by hitting Alt N, but I don't have so any of my better. other cameras. Is it better? <laughs> yes. That is. Yeah, that is better. You have, um, I'm going to go back to my you, camera. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, that was just me showing the Alt-N working because I don't have any other cameras uh, selected right now, so it shows color bars. Um, so you're looking pretty good. If you can tilt down just a little bit, Mercedes. Sure. We're starting to look so much better, James. Right? Look at that. Now, we, okay, all yes. this time, and we haven't even started the meeting. Uh, so much for that 5 o'clock somewhere. Uh, so there we go. That's much better. Uh, Pam, boy, oh, boy. Uh, so you... <laughs> You're very dark in your face and you're very bright in your background. That's because you're trying to show me your lovely outside. That's problem yes. one. Problem yes. two is I can see that the laptop's on your lap and it's constantly moving because you're shifting your weight. See how I'm shifting my weight, but the camera stays solid. So I'm going to need you to go somewhere else, like your dining room table, if you could go there real quick. Okay, and now I'm concerned because I'm wearing my sweatpants and well, I don't want them to show up. Yeah, we definitely want to prep this and have this handled in advance. If you're going to wear sweats, make sure that your camera shot's perfect and make sure you don't need to get up during your session. However, okay. I would just say don't wear sweats because this way, you know, if you do have to get up, you're actually wearing pants. Uh, something that the newscasters that do sports and a lot of those things have been doing for years, they wear their shorts where they have a blazer overhead, but they know they're not going to stand up. So uh, now that we've got that, go ahead and sit down, Pam. Okay. And hopefully your camera will be at the right level because another big thing, oh, perfect, it's not. So your camera <laughs> is not at the right level. See how it's looking up at you? The camera's kind of mm -hmm. tilted upwards. You're tilting upwards. I would love to see if you have it, a Kleenex box, Ooh. something like this, that will allow you to raise your camera up. You just put this on the on the table. You put your camera, uh, your laptop on top of it, and that will make your webcam, this little guy right here that I'm pointing at, that'll give it... Uh, the same level as your eye. And now you know you have what's called a neutral shot when you're filming. Okay. Well, I used to have a box of file folders, right? File here folders work. Have... Books, oh. books, books are great. File books folders are great. are great. Kleenex boxes are great. Uh, that might, that'll work great as well. Um, as long as your laptop doesn't fall off, it doesn't look like it will. Looks like there's rubber pads. Yes. Scott, it's a nice thing. I got this uh, by on a work day with Danny. Cool. This is perfect. And so if you notice, there we go. Now we're going to just tilt. Now you you now the important thing is when you lean forward to tilt, everybody does this and it's like, is that what you want? Perfect. Then they lean back. See how much headroom you have? So you want to almost come up here and you have to say, "Okay, I'm going to I'm going to reach out without moving my frame and I'm going to tilt down as good as I can here, as well as I can." And now I know that I have a good framing. So are you comfortable, Pam? You look good. I feel good. Super let's let's center your shot just a little bit. Okay. If we don't mind. So just, you see how your camera, you just move your laptop left to right. See how it, that's kind of what we call a pan. A little more, a little more. We want you centered. Je <laughs> a little more. <laughs> okay. To your left, to your left. Keep on coaching. To my, to to my left. left. Yep. More to your left. There we go. Okay. So now I just want you to do one tiny little tilt down, a little bit more of a tilt down. Good. Now kind of sit back just a hair. There you go. Look at that. 
Are and you super entertained to see where I am located in relation to my computer right now? I'm. <laughs> we're <laughs> we're going to have you join by the way, the, the, your Zoom on your phone and we'll see it. Um, so I do want to center you because I get to be picky. You're kind of shifting your weight this way. So I want you to be a little more front facing and then just tilt. The, yeah, actually, that kind of solved the problem. So now remember how we started, however it was 10 minutes ago, probably now, uh, I think it was about 10 minutes. Uh, now, if you look at all of our shots, minus Danny, who's now just a wonderful picture of himself, um, you'll see, oh, actually he went away because I have it set to non-video. So uh, the six of us actually look like we're ready for a really nice panel and you have consistency in all six of your shots. So, and the, the only thing I would say is anybody that has a headset, Having a headset allows us to hear and turn up our own volume that's super loud or super quiet, depending on what we want. But it also eliminates any uh, Zoom cross talk that one might hear if your speakers are too loud. Because if I'm talking and your speakers are too loud, Zoom hears me and they do a really good job at what's called echo cancellation. But if you're too loud, sometimes it'll get confused. And so it might start adding me in as an echo and things like that. And I can, I can um, kind of demonstrate that, for example, if I have this uh, too loud. You hear a little here uh, kind of sounds weird. So that's because I have another zoom set up, but I'm muting that now that can cause an echo if it hears another uh, zoom going into that signal. But now that we have everybody set right, everybody's eye level, that's called neutrality. We want the, the shot to be neutral, right? If I'm shooting like this, that's not a good shot. It looks like I'm talking down to everyone. I'm really mad at you for going into the cookie jar. See how bad that looks? Now the opposite, if we're if you're on a webcam and you're like this, it's like, I'm really sorry, I won't do it again. That doesn't look <laughs> good either, right? So now we just have everybody set and I have the luxury of scooting in and out my chair and then framing myself here. And then we have bottom of the chest, top of the head, eyes are around the top third of the screen, very little headroom on top. It's a well-framed shot. So once we do that and all of us have that, it can look like such a professional panel. So Joe, after that all is said, now you can take it away. Well, I love it. Thank you so much. Now we are ready to have now a great meeting. And now we're out of time. <laughs> we are. <laughs> we are ready to have a great meeting. Yes. Are you? Fall Q. Fall Q. All Q. right. Have a great Fall Q, everybody. Thank you so much. And we will see you in the virtual fall. Have a good night.